first came and did my introduction here eight weeks ago, you might recall that I kind of related myself to one of the other participants that I feel like a, a bull in a china shop sometimes, where I have issues controlling um, or dealing with other people that might be facing negative situations and uh, confrontation in the workplace, things like that. So um, relating back to a story that I've had in the last eight weeks, I had a call from uh, one of our operations guys, which is a big difference in my organization, a 40-year veteran versus me with almost 10 years now. Um, this person called and challenged a decision that I made. And he actually called me and emailed and copied the world, of course, on the email. Uh, potential for me to go down the hall, talk to my coworkers, complain about the person, and probably waste a lot of time and cause a lot of stress as well. Instead, I, um, I went back to the person, emailed, said this was a strategy that I decided upon, this is the reason that I decided upon it, thank you for your recommendation, I can really appreciate the fact that your experience has led you to believe that this would have been the correct way to go, but the decision I made is this, and this is the reason, and um, thank you. And I called them to follow up as well, to maintain a very positive attitude in my communication. And um, as a result, I feel that I was more productive, I gained more respect in the organization, and I showed better leadership while working on my brand. So by giving appreciation and um, saying thank you to the person and respecting their seniority, I think I was able to garner more respect and be seen as a better leader in the organization. So six months from now, I am continuing to lead my brand, and I'm taking on more projects, as I have been in the last Eight, eight weeks or so, it feels like I think that um, my supervisors have recognized the fact that I do get things done and I do lead people well. And so that's where I see myself.